Good morning. Thank you for joining us on Renew, a daily devotional for you. Today is May the 20th, 2020, Wednesday, Wise Wednesday. So we turn to our proverb, chapter 20, since it's the 20th day of May, and we see the subject matter in verse number five. Counsel in the heart of a man is like deep water, but a man of understanding will draw it out. Dig until you reach water. If you travel to Greensboro, Kansas, you can pay a visit to what is billed as the world's largest hand dug well. Construction on the well began in the 1880s. As the railroads made their way across Kansas, a reliable source of water for steam engines was essential. The work was done by teams of men using hand tools, shovels, picks, half barrels, pulleys, and rope. As they made their way downward, they lined the well shaft with limestone rock. They finished the well more than 100 feet deep and more than 30 feet in diameter. It took enormous effort to reach the water, but it produced lasting results. I wonder if our brother Art Salvador can match this well drilling as he's a well driller and works with water in our congregation here. The Bible likens wise counsel to water in a deep well. Good advice is just not lying around on the surface. It takes work to find. There are plenty of people who have no idea what they're talking about, but will be more than happy to give you a piece of their mind. And sadly, there will be plenty of people to give you advice that goes directly against the authority and commandments of Scripture. Anyone who wishes to be truly wise and reap the benefits of godly counsel is going to have to reject the simple approach and put forth effort. But the effort is worth it. The Bible says in Psalm 1, 1, Blessed is a man that walketh not in the counsel of the ungodly. If we reject the counsel of the world and seek the counsel of wise men, it will bring God's blessings on our lives and keep us on the right path. Oh, my heart breaks for those who know the right path, decide to go off it, miss God's will for their life. Do not let the effort required to find good counsel keep you from this important task. Dig until you reach water. If you put forth the effort to find and receive wise counsel, you will be rewarded. Dig until you reach water. Let us pray. Dear Father, we ask you to be with each one this day today. Help us to keep looking up. This is a day that the Lord has made. And Lord, we thank you that you've given us wise counsel. But we have to look for it. We have to want it. We have to hunger for it. We have to let the Holy Spirit give it to us. It's found in the Word of God. It's found in preaching. It's found in good, sincere people who do, want to do the right thing. So help us be willing to dig and get wise counsel and then follow it when we find it and realize when we're not getting wise counsel, when we're being deceived. Bless all the folks today. Give them a wonderful day in their families. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Hope you have a wonderful day today. I'd like to leave you with our verse, Romans chapter 12 and verse 2. And be not conformed to this world, but be ye transformed by the renewing of your mind, that you may prove what is that good and acceptable and perfect will of God. Good day now.